Irvin Magic Johnson's life has been magic for the past 60 years on and off the court. This man has a smile that lights up a television screen from here to Bangor, Maine. However, at the lowest point of his career, he was infected with HIV at a time when the disease was still regarded as a death sentence, and it was his family that had his back when the news got out. So let's learn more about Magic's supportive family, starting with his dad. Irvin Magic Johnson was born in Lansing, Michigan in August 1959. He was the fourth son of his parents' seven kids. His father, Irvin Sr., had three other children from a previous relationship, making Magic one of ten children. Magic was raised in a three-bedroom home in Lansing, Michigan as one of nine siblings in a large family. Despite living a modest lifestyle, the parents always made sure the children were well cared for. Irvin Sr. had to take on a second job in addition to his job at General Motors in order to make ends meet. Every Sunday, Irvin Sr., who used to play basketball, would watch NBA games with his sons, and Magic, who used to play with his father down the street, was always trying to beat him as a kid. Magic once stated that his father was instrumental in teaching himself and his siblings the value of hard work, saying, quote, his dad didn't care if he scored 40 points for his high school team Friday night, he had to get up at 6 a.m. Saturday to assist his father at work." End quote. Magic's hard work would eventually pay off as he became a star at Michigan State and a true legend while playing for the Los Angeles Lakers. His dad, Irvin Sr., is described in a book as a steadfast blue-collar father, which is why he was surprised when his then 19-year-old son turned down a deal worth nearly half a million dollars. Irvin Sr. revealed to his own son how he spent his entire life working in a factory for the contract Magic was being offered for a year. Well, in Magic's defense, he went on to become the highest paid rookie in NBA history, signing a $500,000 contract. Magic's parents have been staunch supporters of his career ever since. In 2020, he paid tribute to both of them on Instagram. In August 2020, he quoted a Bible verse in honor of his mother's 85th birthday, saying, quote, Her children rise up and call her blessed, her husband also, and he praises her. Many women have done excellently, but you surpass them all. End quote. Magic has also said of his parents that his dad was his hero and he got his personality from his mother. Magic's mom, Christine, worked as a lunchroom supervisor at a school. While his father had played in high school in Mississippi and frequently watched NBA games as he grew up, his mother had also played the game when she was younger. I guess we can see that it's a family thing. Magic's talent was always there, and when he was 15 years old, he recorded a triple-double during a high school game, earning him the nickname Magic. Christine, a devoted Christian, considered the name to be blasphemous back then, as you'd expect from a typical religious mother. <laughs> Christine had a strong distaste for the name, she preferred Junior or Junebug as his childhood neighbors used to call him, and so did her husband. Christine and Irvin Sr. have been married for more than six decades now, however in 1991 the family was shocked to learn that Magic had been diagnosed with HIV. Christine recalled how she felt when Magic informed her about it. She described it as the worst moment of her life. According to her, it hit her like a ton of bricks. Her faith was helpful in dealing with the crisis. Magic has six other siblings, Yvonne Johnson, Larry Johnson, Michael Johnson, Kim Johnson, Pearl Johnson, and Quincy Johnson. While we couldn't find much information about Yvonne Johnson or Magic's other siblings, let's turn our attention to Magic's brother, Larry Johnson. On a special night at Florida Gulf Coast University, the brother of Magic Johnson once opened up about his dark past and how he overcame it. Larry Johnson shared how he inspired people to take control of their futures. Basketball was a shared passion between him and his brother. According to Larry, the famous no-look pass came from him and not his brother Magic. Larry revealed that although he never got credit for it, he was okay with it. He always aspired to play basketball in the NBA, but instead the dream came true for his brother. Larry missed his shot because he started selling and doing drugs. A quick piece of advice for kids, don't do drugs. Before Larry finished high school, he said that his life started to take a different turn than that of his brother. He was introduced to heroin and cocaine and descended down a dark path of substance abuse and crime. Larry ended up getting arrested 14 different times, and there was one time he almost took his own life. 
He revealed that he could recall people then telling him he was going to die with a spike in his arm, but now he could proudly say he is somebody today. Somebody who turned his life around and overcame addiction, started visiting hospitals, prisons, and treatment facilities so that his words could help others escape the shadows and enter the light. Larry explained that in addition to working with aspiring athletes and students who have a dream and providing guidance so they don't miss their chance, he founded a group called Brotherhood Against Drugs. According to J. Webb Horton, Assistant Director of Community Outreach at FGCU, having someone like Larry Johnson, who is a loving testimony to recovery, has had a huge impact on students. And that's everything we could dig up on the Johnson siblings. Magic's wife and kids are up next. Cookie Johnson was born on January 20th, 1959 in Alabama. She is a businesswoman and author who went to Council Training School, an all-black institution, and later graduated from Michigan State University with a bachelor's degree in textiles and apparel, where she also met Magic Johnson. Based on the character from the TV series 77 Sunset Strip, her mother gave her the nickname Cookie. Cookie worked in retail after graduating from college before moving to Los Angeles, California to work for a sportswear company. She created the CJ brand of jeans, which remained in production for approximately six years. Magic and his wife Cookie are one of Hollywood's most recognizable couples. The NBA player and his wife have been together off and on for over 40 years, making them one of the few couples in Hollywood who have maintained a long-term relationship despite difficulties. Cookie and Magic met as freshmen at Michigan State University in 1977. Their first encounter was at a club where Magic asked for her phone number before leaving for the holiday season. He took her on their first date to a real steakhouse after she returned to campus from the holidays. The couple married in a small private wedding in Lansing in September 1991. They have a son named Irvin III, nicknamed EJ, and adopted a daughter named Elisa in 1995. Cookie wrote her first book, Believing in Magic, in which she discussed everything she and Magic went through from the day they met until they married and then his HIV diagnosis. She explained in her book that after receiving the diagnosis, she chose to stay rather than leave, believing in him. Cookie now works to raise HIV awareness. She mentioned that the toughest thing Magic ever had to do was tell her about his HIV diagnosis. The couple once talked about the impact the diagnosis had on their marriage in an interview with CBS Mornings. Magic explained that it was hard because he loved his wife so much and hated to hurt her. He explained that he had played against some of the best basketball players in the world, been in championships, and been in nine NBA finals, so he knew what it was like to feel pressure. However, according to Magic, there was no greater pressure than driving home to tell Cookie about his diagnosis. The couple had only been married for a little over a month when Los Angeles Lakers team doctor Michael Melman broke the news in 1991. At the same time, Cookie also found out she was pregnant as well. Cookie, on the other hand, was more worried about his well-being after he revealed that he most likely acquired the illness through sex. Due to the stigma attached to the illness, she initially opposed Magic holding a press conference to announce his HIV diagnosis. She had felt at the time that people weren't educated, so she didn't want people to treat them like they were lepers. In a specially chosen outfit, she eventually joined her husband on stage for his announcement. Magic still needs to take a cocktail once a day of medications to help keep his HIV under control, even though it is currently undetectable. He is a proud father of three children, two of them are well known for their modeling and reality TV careers, but his eldest son, Andre Johnson, likes to stay out of the spotlight. Magic had his eldest son Andre with his then-girlfriend Melissa Mitchell 10 years before marrying Cookie. Despite the fact that Andre was mostly raised by his mother due to Magic's hectic schedule, he has a strong bond with Magic and the rest of their family. They are frequently seen together on special occasions and during the summer. Andre earned an associate's degree in business management from Santa Monica College in 2002. Soon after, he began working as vice president of business development for his father company, Magic Johnson Enterprises. He served in that capacity from 2004 to 2010 and was later promoted to executive vice president of the company. However, from 2014 to 2018, he was also the co-founder of another company called Love Plus Light. Andre then worked as a producer at Hydra Entertainment before becoming the head of business 
business development at the Virtual Reality Company. He is currently the vice president for business development for Mythical Games, a game technology studio. He is married to Lisa Myers Johnson, and they have two children, Gigi and Avery. Lisa, like her husband, is a businesswoman, but she is more committed to giving back to the community through her efforts. She co-founded the Private School Village, a nonprofit organization that aims to unite and foster a sense of community among black and African American families whose children attend private schools in Los Angeles. They foster community by organizing social gatherings, sharing resources, and providing programs for black African American families in independent schools. By collaborating with parents, students, and private schools, they also assist students in realizing their full potential. Gigi, Andre's daughter, is a gifted athlete who plays basketball and and volleyball. She also enjoys acting and has appeared in school productions. She has also done some modeling, such as walking on the runway of the Ladylike Foundation Luncheon, due to her tall height and model-like figure. Andre's younger son Avery, who enjoys sports as much as his grandfather does, plays basketball and baseball. Gigi and Avery are frequently seen socializing with their grandparents, Magic and Cookie. Now Magic's second son. Magic and his wife Cookie married in 1991, one year before he retired from the Los Angeles Lakers. His son EJ was born soon after, making headlines even before he was born. Since he has emerged as a celebrity in his own right over the past few years and has shared his own account of coming out to his parents as a gay black man, EJ's star hasn't dimmed. It took some time for Magic to accept the news, but he eventually did. EJ is, of course, a supporter of the LGBTQ plus community and identifies as gender fluid. In 2018, he made an appearance on CNN's This Is Life and talked about his identity. He went to New York University to study hospitality, majoring in event design and planning. He is an actor, socialite, and television personality. He has also filled in on E! News and hosted other shows in addition to serving as a guest host on Fashion Please. He also appeared on Real Husbands of Hollywood. 2014 saw the debut of EJ's now defunct fashion blog, and he is currently flexing his acting skills in the revival of With Love and The Proud Family, Louder and Prouder. EJ Johnson's net worth is estimated at over $5 million. Elisa, the now 28-year-old, was adopted at the age of two by Magic and his wife. She is a businesswoman and a prominent figure in the fashion industry. Elisa was born in 1994 in California. Due to her family's fame, she grew up in the spotlight, which made her feel like she was constantly being watched. This made it challenging for her to emerge from her wealthy family's shadow. She is interested in fashion, just like her mother and brother EJ, and in 2021, she debuted her own line of sunglasses. She attended FIT while starting her own company, Elisa Johnson Company. Elisa claims that her brand was influenced by her lack of conformity. She detested wearing school uniforms, so she turned to fashion as a means of self-expression. She always wanted to be unique and different, and through fashion and accessories, she could express herself in the ways that she wanted. Elisa also claims that because everyone was aware of her identity, she felt more pressure when delivering her line. She had already made the decision to sell sunglasses full-time by the time she graduated, and she claims that because she had previously stated her desire to become an actor and singer, her parents did not take her seriously. Elisa, however, eventually won Magic's backing after developing a strong business strategy. Learn something new about Magic Johnson today? Well, check out the videos above to learn even more about other NBA players.